Hello everyone, Black Ice here, and welcome back to the Stanley Parable. Last time we left off, we did all kinds of crazy things, including playing other games besides the Stanley Parable. But um, today, I'm going to go through the thing. Don't know exactly what I'm going to do yet, but after this narrator says something real quick, I just want to make a quick note, because I know he's going to talk about it. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Right, okay, missed a memo. I just wanted to make a quick note that in this video, I'm going to have to be recording with a cough drop in my mouth at all times, because otherwise I risk having a coughing fit on the video, which, you know, both things not very good for videos, but I am choosing the lesser of two evils, so we'll try not to make the thing noticeable, but um, if you get bothered by that kind of thing, you might want to just uh, tune out now. But I will try my best. So, just thought I'd give you guys a heads up. Still very sick, unfortunately. It's just the cough that keeps getting worse, and it's, you know, coughs are not good for videos. But anyway, let's go on. Where is the thing? Um, I might, oh yeah. Let's turn this off. We don't need that. Oh wait, was this guy sending an email? Yeah, that looks like he's sending an email. Not anymore. <laughs> I wonder what's over there. That looks interesting. I want to go in that room. Alright, let's get out of here. And let's see. Are you gonna say something now? Oh yeah, two open doors. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No, I'm gonna I'm actually gonna do the left one this time. We'll see what happens. Can't go in there. Can't go in any of these still. Apparently there's something Yet funny in there was not doors. a single person read it though. Either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. The future was yesterday, tomorrow is now. Okay. Um, lots of synergy going on over here. Maybe this wasn't the right board. I don't know what I'm looking for, actually. Maybe this one? No, that's just a calendar. Alright, so, this is, um... Very important slideshow. I recommend everyone watch this if you are trying to be an employee um, at a place. Wait a minute, is this the thing? Okay, yeah, we saw that. We saw, did we see this one? Monetize free to play. Um, no. Don't do that, please. Alright, let's get out of here. Room closet. Ha ha ha, I'm not going in there again. Alright, so last time we went Coming downstairs. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's I'm office. I'm gonna go upstairs because, you know, it's the way the narrator says to go. I'm not going to always listen to him, but... Alright, this door, I heard you can go back through it. And juke it out. I'm going to try. Uh, almost. Oh, I'm not going to be able to do it. Oh, wait. Haha. -ha. Oh, maybe I have to... Uh, well, let's try this again. No. Come on. I don't know. How far away do you have to be from this door? Is it is it stuck open now? I think I I think I broke it. Yeah, that's stuck open. Um let's see if I start going down here, is he gonna say something? No. Odd, okay, um well that door's stuck. Ooh, the executive bathroom. Oh, man, we can't get in there. I've always wanted to be in an executive bathroom. This place is kind of weird. It's like the ceiling with the lights and the way the ceiling is doesn't match the rest of the style of the room. Because you got these nice wood floors, nice uh, wallpaper there, and, you know, just a white ceiling with weird fluorescent lights at the top. Ooh, is this... Can I hack your computer guy? Nope. Guess not. Can I go in here? Cannot. Oh, this is some cool office this guy has. Maybe I can juke these doors. Stepping into. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I did it. I broke the game. Okay, uh, maybe I shouldn't be juking these doors. I think he wanted me to go in there. Uh oh. Well. That's not how I wanted it to happen, actually. I don't think that was supposed to be a thing. Um, we might have to restart this one. Okay. 
don't know where to go. Uh, I don't want to go downstairs anymore. I can't get out of here. Maybe if I go in the broom closet for a bit, it, like, and he'll say something, and then it'll reset it. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, it seems like there's a lot less in here than last time. Are you gonna say something, guy? Just say one thing and I'm out of here. Trust me, I will not be in here long. Uh oh. I think I broke the game. Yeah, because I can go back through all these doors, actually. See how far back I can go. Can I go through the door on the right, then? Yeah. Oh. Oh, I can't. Well, everything else is open. What the heck? I don't think that's supposed to be a thing. Um, Mr. Narrator? Are you okay? I don't think he's happy with what I did. Just click on this a few times. No, that doesn't get his attention. Uh-oh. Oh, what's in here? What the? What is this? <laughs> oh, no. I don't know where I am. Ooh. Okay. You are now leaving. Um, interesting. Okay, there's an elevator here. Escape pod bay 4760. There's an elevator that I can't go in. And, ooh. Oh, I know where I am. That's where I was. Whoa. What was that flash? Uh, but that's that door th 430 that I was clicking on just a few seconds ago. So that's where I was. Can I go in here? No. I have to go to the escape pod bay. That sounds pretty cool, though. I think I would like these. Get Whoa. I have a feeling this place looks weird. And the narrator hasn't said a thing. What is going on? Wait a minute. That's 4.30 again. How? Uh-oh. Um. Is this an infinite loop or something? Because I went up... And here I am again at 4.30. Still can't open any doors. I guess I should keep going up, and if I don't find anything up, then I'll just go down. Oh, man, this is so hard to see. I'm sorry if you can't see this on YouTube, because I, I can barely see it, but YouTube usually brightens things up a little bit. Alright, yeah, this is actually... The numbers are increasing, though. I think. So it said 5.57, and now it's going to say 5.58, so yes. I'm going up, but they... Maybe there's just multiple versions of this room here on every floor or something. That'd be really odd. But I wouldn't put it past this game. I really wouldn't. You never know. Oh, man. Where are the things? Okay, there's the stairs. Okay. 59, and just one more, and I'll be in the escape pod bay. You know, if this thing didn't lie to me. Uh-oh. Am I going up? Where is the... Okay. Uh, yes, here we go. Going up. Oh, okay. Escape pod launch bay. Um, is that this way? Escape. Let's escape. Um, I don't see anything in this room at all. I'm just gonna kind of have my back towards the door so I can get an idea of how, you know, depth perception or whatever. Oh, wait a minute, is that a light switch over there? I'm going to just go check if that's a light switch or just I'm seeing things. I might just be seeing things, but if it's a light switch, I need to hit it. Nope, not a light switch, unfortunately. Oh no, there's a thing. Oh, I didn't see that before. Alright, let's go to this door at the end of the long hallway. The long and very dark hallway. What the heck is this? This is not a door, is it? Oh, that's the escape pod. Can I get in? Uh-oh. Well, here we go. Here's the loading screen. What? That's the ending? That's so weird. Interesting. Well, that was kind of a fast one, so, you know what? Let's do another one today. Let's do the one I intended to do in the first place. Well, I didn't really intend to do it either, but I accidentally messed up at the second set of doors there. All of his co-workers were gone. That is what weird. Mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. And like, this is where the memo. thing was, so... No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. Okay, okay, okay. I'll, I'll go, I'll go. Let's go on. But yeah, that's weird. The windows there are white. 
So, was I outside the whole time, or I don't know what was going on there, to be honest. Well, let's just head on down the hallway. Oh, wait, this is different. This is... what the heck? This is not the same. No, this room definitely was not here, because these are the two open doors. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Alright, let's go to the left. This is so weird. Why would the thing change? Alright, this part looks the same, though. Yet, there was not a single mm -hmm. person here, either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Wait, did I just... Did I just step on the chair? I want to get on the table. No, I don't think I did. Eh, oh well. Alright, yeah, let's go to the boss's office, I guess. Room closet, hello. Can I close it? I can close it. Good. Don't want to go up there. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Alright, let's go. I'm not going to break it again. Can I go into the executive bathroom this time? Maybe... <gasps> yes! I've done it! Because the boss knows that the boss... That what the... Okay. Let's start over. Because the boss knows that what the boss says goes. If the boss has suffered losses, then that's what the boss chose. Interesting. So you got Extreme Bathrooms Magazine, Time Magazine with an actual clock on it or something. Can I go in the toilet? No. Oh, wow, this is a really crappy mirror. Other than that, though, this bathroom is really nice. Man, I, I wish I had a bathroom like this. I mean, you got the nice window. It's, uh, it's not really that small. Just, you know, you got some nice paintings. You got a nice pot of plants and cups in case you get thirsty while you're on the toilet. Because that's what everyone does when they go on the toilet. They drink stuff. Toilet paper over there. Alright, this is a very nice executive bathroom. Let's, uh... So what was that? Can I... Yes. I'm very happy with that. Very, very much happy with that. Oh, okay. That's fine. Can I go in here? Ooh, I can go in here. I think that's the way I'm supposed to go, but I want to go in here first. Oh, there's an elevator. Indoors monthly. Graphs. Some more papers on the ground. There's a panda. Oh no, they got a gun to the panda's head. Business strategy. Or strategy. Strategy. Strategy? Is that even a word? That might be a word. That's not nice. Oh, oh, and then what's this one say? Let's see. I can't. I am the most expensive boss. <laughs> okay, well, I don't really like this place if they put guns to pandas' heads. Can I go in the elevator? Uh oh. I don't know if I want to go down or up. Let's go up. I don't know if that makes a difference or not, but let's do it. Going up. Oh man, this best elevator music ever. I'm surprised the narrator hasn't shown up in a while though. I don't think he likes when I go into these secret places because he's got nothing to say about them. Wait, is the elevator gonna like break or something? That'd be kind of scary. All right. Well, um. Would... Oh, there's the narrator. Uh, this is the long elevator ride. Where am I going? Listen closely, you can hear the narrator whispering. Not right now. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just hearing things. Nope, that was definitely him. Interesting. Um, can I get out? Okay, here I am. I'm out now. Wait a minute. We didn't go anywhere. Let's go let's try going down this time. Let's go down. Nope, nope. I said down, 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 down. There we go. No, I want to go down. Down, please. Down, down. Alright, here we go. 
I'll give it a few seconds. I don't know if this actually does anything, though. It might just be a box that you go in and it shakes a little bit and plays elevator music. Alright, yeah, this is taking too long. Let's... I want, I want out! Worst elevator ever. Alright, let's, let's get out of here. Alright, here we are. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. What could it mean? Stanley wondered aloud to nobody. He began wildly tearing through papers on the boss's desk, pulling books off the shelf, looking behind paintings, desperate for clues to his situation. But his attention was caught by a keypad behind the boss's desk. What Ooh, could its purpose it. be? In fact, this keypad guarded the terrible secret that lay buried below his feet. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret pin number. Ooh, 2845. 2845. But of course, huh? Stanley couldn't possibly have known this. <laughs> I get it. This is a really nice office, though, I gotta say. Um, I wish I had an office. They even have a fireplace Stanley here. just crazy. sat around twiddling his thumbs. No, I know. Trying to input anything on the device was useless, since he could never possibly know that the combination was 2845. Nope, I could never possibly know that the combination is 2845. Yet incredibly, by simply pushing random buttons on the keypad, Stanley happened to input the correct code hey, by I... sheer luck. That wasn't amazing. luck. He stepped into the newly opened oh. passageway. Okay, so that wasn't the fireplace. Interesting. I knew that was too good to be true. You can't have a fireplace in your office. I guess you can, but... Oh, this place is weird. How does this go? There's an elevator down. This thing over here... That seems to end with this wall there. Alright, let's go to the elevator down then. Hopefully this elevator actually does something. Down we go! Awesome, let's see what's down here. Come on, load faster please, that would be very nice if that could happen. Here we go. Descending deeper into the building, Stanley realized he felt a bit peculiar. It was a stirring of emotion in his chest, as though he felt more free to think for himself, to question the nature of his job. Why did he feel this now, when for years it had never occurred to him? This question would not go unanswered for long. Ooh, we're gonna find some answers, guys. Wow, what is this place? Stanley walked Ooh. straight ahead through the large door what? that read Mind Control Facility. Mind Control Facility, huh? Or we could escape. Mind Control Facility or escape. Bye. Although this passageway had the word escape written on it, the truth was that at the end of this hall, Stanley would meet his violent death. Oh. I don't know if that's true or not. I don't see anything there. Well, you know what? We escaped earlier in the episode with the escape pod thing, so let's keep the theme. Let's go escape. I don't, I'm not buying it, Mr. Narrator. No. The door behind him was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. Well, see, the narrator's been acting really weird so far this episode. Like, he got really quiet for really long time. At this sometimes. point, Stanley was making a conscious, concerted effort to walk forward and willingly confront his death. Yeah, well, I don't believe you, guy. I mean, look, this does not look like a death room. Or maybe it kind of does. Eh, we're gonna escape. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, maybe he was right. Okay. Dude, acting so weird this episode, I don't know if I could trust him anymore. This guy. Oh, yeah, here. This Okay, how did I not die from the fall? Where the heck are we? As the machine whirred into motion, and Whoa. Stanley was inched closer and closer to his eyes, oh. he reflected that his life had been of no good oh, whatsoever. Stanley can't see the bigger picture. He doesn't know the real story, trapped forever in his narrow vision of what this world is. Perhaps his death was of no great loss, like plucking the eyeballs from a blind man. 
so he resigned and willingly accepted this violent end to his brief and shallow life. Fair point, Stanley. Uh, here it goes. Oh, I knew Farewell, I wouldn't Farewell, Stanley, cried the narrator, as what? Stanley was led helplessly into the enormous metal jaws. In a single visceral instant, Stanley was obliterated as the machine crushed every bone in his body, killing him instantly. But I didn't die. And the narrator has a narrator. What the heck? What is this? What is this game? The Stanley Parable apparently is what this game is. Um, can I go forward anymore? No, I don't think I can. Oh, no, I and can. yet it would be just a few minutes before Stanley would restart the game back in his office as alive as ever. What? What exactly did the narrator think he was going to accomplish? What the heck is this place? When every path you can walk has been created for you long in advance, death becomes meaningless, making life the same. Do you see now? Mm -hmm. Do you see that Stanley was already dead from the moment he hit start? Wow, this is really interesting. It's like the game is like right here. That's so weird. The office. Can't go in any of these. No, didn't think so. Ooh, buttons. Yay, buttons. Alright, what the heck is all this though? It's like the Stanley Parable Museum. Oh, and there's credits here. Good job, guys. You guys are awesome. All you people. Where, no, where to go this time? Let's go left. Ooh. This is maintenance room. Haven't seen that before, I don't think. Oh, wow. What are these? Stanley Parable HD remixes to lose. HD remixes to win. Oh, the points of. Okay. Wow, this is really weird. What's in here? Nothing? The narrator's emails. After the second trailer we sent out, we asked people to email the narrator for questions while well, we had initially planned to use these in further promotional materials. We never found the perfect use for them. Here are a selection of those emails. I don't see any... Oh, there they are. Interesting. Oh. <laughs> well, that's kind of cool. You actually have people send in emails to the narrator. I want to send an email to the narrator. I'm going to ask him why he actually sometimes is right. Alright, let's go this way. I really don't know where to go in here, to be honest. Oh, what the heck? There's like chains there. Um, okay. Um, is that where I came from? I don't think so. No, it says exit, so... Maybe I don't want to go there quite yet. Oh, what's this? Ooh. Oh, man, I wish my setup was like this. That's awesome. I just have this. I need the rest of those, though. Alright, and that looks like to be where I came from. Ooh, more offices. Uh, the middle one, I guess, is what they opted for. It's very nice, I gotta say. What is in here? I don't know what any of this stuff is, by the way, guys. This is weird. Oh, okay, that's where I was. Escape or mind control facility. Shows escape. Oh, this is like an interrogation room. Then he pushed the number four. And um. Okay. There's outtakes somewhere here, but I I can only slightly hear them. I don't know if that's quite right. They're like very faint whispers. That's kind of cool. Alright, I think we can get out of here then. Is this... Yeah, that's... Okay, let's get out of here. Because I think we've seen everything. To the exit. Although this is very... Very odd. Can I hit any of these buttons? No, I don't think I can. No, it doesn't seem like it. Alright, let's, let's leave. The Stanley Parable. <laughs> oh, look at these two. How they wish to destroy one another. How they wish to control one another. How they both wish to be free. Okay. Bye. Can you see? Can you see how much they need one another? No, perhaps not. 
Sometimes these things cannot be seen. Interesting. But listen to me. You can still save these what? two. You can stop the program before they both fail. Push escape and press quit. There's no other way to beat this game. As long as you move forward, you'll be walking someone else's uh -oh. path. Stop now and it'll be your only true choice. Whatever you do, choose it. Don't let time choose for you. Don't let... Okay, um, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do escape and press quit. I think that's what she said. We're breaking the fourth wall here. I'm just gonna see if that brings anything up. See if anything changes. If so, it'll probably be another episode, but we'll see. We will see. Um, this yeah, let's is skip this. Alright, I'm gonna play this one through as another episode, so, um, anyway, that's gonna do it for me for today, so thank you all so much for watching, really hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video. Till then, goodbye everyone, have a great day.